Hello everyone, it is Ikos Nim and I'm back with more uh, Persona 5. Let's see, last time um, <coughs> last time we skipped um, what is called apparently the gel. Yeah, we skipped the gel here. There's a new type of, uh, well, palaces which apparently now are called gels. Which I just said that a few minutes ago. And yeah, now right now we're gonna have go and try to discover everything about these guys. I mean about this guy. <clears throat> oh, should I say girl? Oh, excuse me, I'm having a little bit of trouble breathing because of the, of the stupid cold. Anyway, Futaba, I need to talk to you apparently. Hmm, I see. What? But how? I mean, with this over here? Damn, so that's it. Yeah, she's really having fun with that. So, what do you think, Futaba? How's Sophia's code look? While her programmer is a genius, no doubt about that. You can figure a person out by their code, and not just their skill level. Their habits, thought processes, even their personalities are there. This code is so Seriously? advanced that even I can't read it and comprehend it right away. It'll take me weeks, even months to actually grasp how Sophia works. Take you months? Oh, that's a serious program. I don't understand. Do you mean I'm impressive? Yeah, I guess he does. Impressive? You're some kind of super AI. If you ever went public, everyone would call Emma old hat. <laughs> old hat? When something was popular at one point but stopped being popular, it becomes old hat. It's a saying people don't really use anymore. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I got it. You are very knowledgeable, Futaba. <laughs> I mean, then again, some uh, stuff, okay? things that became popular, even though they're not really popular, they came back as well. Name or companies, maybe? I noticed that <sighs> happening a lot in life. Yet, and most of those leave a signature of some sort in their work too. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna keep cracking at it from home. I'll let you know once I find anything new. All right then. I'll stay up too late, okay? Need to sleep. Cut me some slack. I'm in vacay mode. <laughs> you still need to rest. Well, folks, time for me to make like a tree. All right then. She made like a tree. I honestly don't get that saying either. What does it mean? Time for me to make like a tree. Oh well. Boy, was that a hell of a day. I never would have I'll imagined say. something like this would happen. Well, I hear you there. You're a real standout. But that just might mean you're going to see some trouble again soon. Alice, Emma, this new metaverse. A mountain of mysteries sure is piling up fast. Well, the metaverse reappearing may have been a surprise, but even that doesn't compare with Sophia. I don't Did know. Me? I mean, the whole thing about Metaverse about coming back, it is... Says um... the talking cat. <laughs> Good point. <coughs> Wait, I don't have to take that from some mystery app. By the way, how does some top-of-the-line program lose all its memory, huh? I mean, AI are supposed to be super smart, right? That is... Oh, boy. Arguably true. Oh dear. Aw, don't get too down over it. I am humanity's companion. If I am not helpful, then I am useless. No, you're don't not. Don't so hard on yourself. At least you remember that much, right? Right. I think that means it's important. But is being helpful all you'll do to become a good companion? Is that not how it works? Please explain. How else can one be a companion? Huh? Well, uh... <laughs> Uh, that's a. Uh, that's a very I complex. Um, have to find a way to understand subject. the human heart. Hearts. Yeah, right. Then you'll be able to empathize with other people and be a good companion to them. I guess. The human heart. I suppose that's a good way to put it. Look, just, just don't worry about it. All you oh, need to do is join us and learn from all the kinds of people we meet. He did. In exchange. You I lend a hand to the cold. 
having my so I guess nose like days and not be able to okay. sleep correctly. Not be able to since it help me a good having trouble breathing. Yep. And then my throat. So long as it's good with our Amazing. I hate this. Okay. I hate we'll this. Do this together. Yeah. And it's a deal. Glad to have you on board, Sophia. We've got plenty of scouting to do tomorrow. We should get some rest. Okay. Good night, Morgana. Good night, sweetie. She's so adorable. Ah. <sighs> yeah, because of this old BS. I was... I was not sure if I should record it or not, but... As I say, the show must go on. And I need to record... In order to get more views right. and subscribers. Everyone's Otherwise... To be you guys is gonna leave me high and dry. I've done this many a time. I can't imagine anyone being phased by this. <laughs> yeah, bro. Bring it. We're very short on intel, so we need to be cautious. We'll just scout the general area for this trip. We use Emma to enter, right? Is there anything special we need to do? Um, no. We just opened the app and said the right keyword. Find the right name yeah, pretty much just like with the old the one. Keyword on the friend request screen. Yeah, you got it, Futaba. Ah, leave it to the super hacker to explain this stuff. That had nothing to do with hacking. Even you should know how to explain it. <laughs> yeah. All that's left is to choose our point of entry. There will be no enemies in the area from which we escaped yesterday. Upon reaching the relevant location, you will only need to speak the keyword. Seems all that's left is to trust Sophia and see where she leads us. Let's do this thing. There you go. Back to this. And look at that. We have the whole crew well, together. Did we make well, it? almost all the crew. We don't have two of them. Phantom thief attire. Yeah, you do. Oh, I've forgotten this feeling. The fusion of form and function. Truly magnificent. Look, it's oh, good Beauty for you. Thief. My name is Beauty Thief. Oh my god, Haru. That's <laughs> not for All the memories. Here. I admit, though, these clothes do bring back some memories. They we do. We reminisce later. Take a look at that view. So, this is the jail? Just what is that building? This place is bonkers. Nothing it's escapes huge. the atrocious color scheme. Look at that! A red moon! It looks like that because of someone's cognition, correct? Right. Most likely Alice's. The distortion has to be exceptionally strong there for a reason. So you're saying that's the stronghold of the Queen ruling over this jail? Its appearance certainly fits the notion. Buildings around here still look pretty normal, though. Looks like that place over there has a limited range of distortion. The first time we came here, we entered by the crossing down there. Mm. That's where we saw a group of cop shadows taking stuff out of people's chests. Oh, you mean that jewel we saw? How was up with that? That may have been a desire. Oh, hey, Sophie. Sophie. Thieves? <gasps> oh my God, sweetie. <laughs> Come down, oh, you're so cute, Sophia. Such yes. a fascinating form you've taken. I can't stop staring at the beautifully curved lines. I've never down, seen boy, an down. outfit like that. Can I try floofing it? Floofing? I think she wants to get a feel for the fabric of your clothes while hugging you, Sophia. Request denied. I am neither a child nor a pet. Aww. No floofing. <laughs> Poor Why Anne. Does age work for oh, then I, I know the Not feeling. Right now. Sophia, tell us more about the desire you mentioned. That is the term used by shadows here. They say things such as, seize their desires, and we must offer these desires to the monarch. Based on their language and behavior, I speculate the aforementioned jewel was in fact a desire. That does make sense. When we saw Alice here, she mentioned desires too. So if Alice uh. is the monarch, then she really is the ruler of this jail. But these desires, are they actually made up of the things people desire? 
seizing desires of all things. What use would they have for those? Finding out what happened to the folks who got jumped could tell us something. Where could those victims be now? I don't see a place from here where they may be held. I don't know. Maybe they're being held somewhere else. Say, about those people you witnessed being attacked, are you sure they were humans? What do you mean? Oh yeah, they could be... Uh... Couldn't they have been shadows or something? If there are humans getting captured and imprisoned in this jail right now, wouldn't there be a huge commotion in our world? Groups of people going missing out of the blue. Now there's a point. I haven't heard a peep about that online. Yeah, that's so maybe, no one is actually maybe that's disappearing it. from reality. You know, just like with the I see. Person, the first shadows. one. What are shadows? You know, a when Yuji wanted to save those athletes, but turns out they were just you know it's basically just shadows. They were, they were not real, Does that like mean puppets. Their main selves are all right? No, the shadow and the actual self are two sides of the same coin. So if a desire is taken from someone's shadow, what happens to the person in reality? I gotta say. I'm getting a bad vibe from all this. Are they trying to influence reality by doing something to the shadows? Then how are we to act? This sounds like a crisis. Shouldn't we rescue the victims right away? No, that was just speculation. After all, we've only witnessed the cognitive world side of things. Until we find out how all this is affecting the real world, we can only know half of what's going on. I'd say the first thing we need to do is investigate Alice and her victims. Plus, if we make the wrong move in the cognitive world, there's a chance the ruler could have a shutdown in the real world. Right. We need to get the story straight before we yeah, make we don't real want it moves or we'll to be doing damage. Oh my god. Sorry, my nose. Uh, how about we start looking to Atlas? Kind of curious about her. Uh, but what are we gonna do? Crashing some random store opening probably only works once. Let's um, get there's into other ways to do it. Okay, let's get out of here. <sighs> and? Hmm. Oh, that was something. Well, we've confirmed the presence of the jail. Next, we look into Alice and any potential victims. And how do we do that? Look into what? The usual rumor mills. Looking for anything about Alice. Gossip about her being abusive or other messed up stuff. Good idea. Let's gather any intel that we can, both online and on the streets. <sighs> I've got the web crawling covered. But if we're ever to gain conclusive proof oh, of right any there. rumors, I believe we'll need direct access to her at some point. Direct access to a pop star sounds awfully tough. Uh... Hmm. Man? Hey, okay. Uh, about that. I may get to meet Alice tomorrow. What? What? For real? How? Well, I had asked the modeling agency's president if I could meet her sometime. I heard she'd be on a TV show filming nearby, so I asked if I could visit the set. I was hoping to learn from her by watching her in action. I gave up on it after making plans with you guys, but I might be able to get the ball rolling again in time. The timing's nothing short of- Well, how about time. that? Yeah! Way to go, Lady On! I mean, she didn't plan it. And there's no way we'd get to approach her either. Plus, our full group's just too big. The most I could even ask to bring is just one more person. Well then, guess that'll be me. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> you guys. Well, is this payback for last year's Valentine? Shit when you meet her so you can get some evidence out of her. Oh, I cannot wait. Yay. Hey, you better not be thinking of trying anything funny. I'm the one who will suffer for it. Don't worry, it's I'll me talking about. We'll be fine so long I got this. Season. For today, let's focus on her potential victims. Let's go. All right then, let's gather a intel. This is something completely different comparing the first one. As 
you guys can see here. And here we're gonna have to go out and actually try to discover information. Interesting. So, did you find anything? Hmm. Nope. I guess we're gonna go this way. Hmm? Yeah? Sure. Well, let me see. Okay, that's some information. Yes. And God damn it Anne. Why? Do I don't admit those look good. But no, no, wait. I'm also on diet. Fuck that. Hey! So hmm? me this one? So if uh, Monarch steals the the person's shadow desire, they'll become, I guess, obsessed with them. Hmm? 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 Oh yeah, I think you were also one of them. This is not good. Hmm? Bone? Bones? You know, could just tell me right away. I'm standing right here. Whatever. This one? This one has... Hi, welcome. Well, this is not what I wanted, but. I'll take it. That's a popular choice. Carry your items. I'll see Thank you something hmm. hey um Haru may I have a word repeat yourself I may have messed up Dear, can only imagine. Is it this one? Well, fine. I guess I'll press something else. Wait, is it this one? Oh, so it's this one. I suppose it makes sense with all sparkly and. 
stars and whatever that thing is. It looks like Ferrero. Now I want some Ferrero. Really? Wait, what? Jesus Christ. Well, there you go. <coughs> oh, God, my <coughs> oh, my, my apologies. I just had a coughing fit. Ooh. But yeah, I was gonna say that um, this is all pretty much you have to do now. Instead of waiting like a few days to find out information and everything. No, we have to go around and ask people or go into a shopping do? center or something. And that's how you do it. What's true? So how'd it go? Anyone learn anything useful about potential victims? Yeah, we spotted a couple familiar faces. We found some of the people who were attacked in the jail. You really found them? Which means yep. the ones ambushed in the jail were indeed only their shadows and not their human forms. <laughs> yep, still just the shadows of the people. All acting real weird. Weird how? They're all totally crazy for Alice. They're even getting loans so they can buy more yeah, shit Yeah, crazy is a nice way to say That's it. It's pretty weird. Now that you mention it, I saw others behaving similarly in Shibuya. Yeah, like this one couple nearly splitting up when the boyfriend bought everything Alice related he could find. There were even people let go from their jobs because they weren't Alice fans themselves. I've even found some reports of Alice fans straight up assaulting outspoken critics of hers. Jesus Christ. At first I figured Alice was just the latest fad, but this seems so much worse than that. Maybe the people who had the desires taken from them went crazy. If that's the case, then we have to do yeah, something. Yeah, so. Agreed. If such aberrant behavior continues to rise, we could easily find ourselves in an unwinnable position. With the metaverse involved, we're the only people who can stop this. Mm-hmm. We have to help. Yeah. It looks like you've finished gathering intel on Alice's victims. Would you like to investigate her next? Yep. Yep. Let's break for today and pick this back up tomorrow after your trip. Good luck with the Alice visit, you three. Thanks. We're on it. Yeah, it's gonna be so much fun. Oh, my nose. You know, make sure I hate being a... having a cold. Because I do. Oh, heading out? Don't be too late coming back. Yes, sir. Oh, he's eating curry. Yeah, I'm totally gonna make curry awesome. today. This curry is fantastic. Boy, shit, this is. Oh, thanks. Oh crap! Looks like he found us. So this is going out live, huh? Even I'm starting to get a little nervous. You still good? Hey, I'm always good. Stay in the bag. If they find out we brought a pet in here, they'll kick us out. I'm surprised those other people didn't are not coming. Yes, behave yourself in there. Uh, well, I guess if I can't be seen, you two do your best to blend in too. We're fine. All we're gonna do is watch. Should I also make efforts to blend in? Yeah, just hang tight for a bit, Sophia. No prob. Here you go. Here she Listen, comes. girl. Miss Alice on the set. Jesus Christ! I still say our outfit is really. Oh, she really is adorable. Running back from Not the really. Uh, she's. Back in she five, looks just weird. Four, three, I can hardly imagine myself now, walking around like that. The hottest meet and greet segment of the show. We have a special guest with us today. She has taken the fashion world by storm and conquered it. Please welcome the designer. Honestly, Alice my style Hiragi. is more uh, similar to more than it is with this girl. <laughs> Thank you for joining us, Alice. You sure have been keeping busy these days, haven't you? It's only thanks to all my fans that I've been able to do what I do. And what a number of fans you have. Talk about strong support. Am I wrong to presume that you designed the outfit you're wearing today? It's just so cute. Very expressive. 
Thank you so much. The theme of my current line is Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> I feel like fashion is a rare and beautiful thing that can take anyone into a world built on their dreams. You can find a side to yourself that maybe you didn't even know you had. Fashion can do so much for us. I try my best to focus on that whenever I design a new piece. Such wise words from a successful industry veteran. What inspiration originally spurred you into fashion design, if you don't mind? <laughs> to be honest, I was very shy growing up. I didn't have any friends at school. I would get so lonely. I wanted to change so much, but I just couldn't figure out how to do it. Then, one day, I saw the most beautiful dress in a shop window. When I put it on, the whole world felt new. It was like I was hit with this blinding ray of light. I really can change. That's what wearing it made me think. I strive each day so. to give that same feeling to every person who tries on one of my designs. If only I was able to I do that, just that buying, buying some new clothes. That's what inspired me I to enter it. the fashion industry. Really? Huh. <laughs> now I can see why the young people love you so much. How do you handle all the dating rumors? Uh, uh, um, you uh, okay? What? Uh, <laughs> you okay? I, you need to go to the bathroom? What's going on? I don't get it. Is this some kind of scripted thing? I wonder what's wrong. Are you okay? Alice. Maybe he ate something? I. I love you, Alice. Please, spend your life with me. What? What the fuck? Uh, hey, what is all this, huh? I didn't realize until now. I love you. Uh, this is really out of the blue. Alright, stop it. <laughs> yeah, this bit's going on a little too long. I mean it. I can't live without you. What? What, what in the hell? And what about me, asshole? Oh dear. Is this real? Those two are engaged already, right? Wow, what a train wreck. I can't believe this. Cut the commercial! No, this is no! right. I'm begging you, Alice, please! No, that is Just not right. Shut up already! What has happened to you? What is this mess? It has to be <laughs> the desire. Oh look, see she, she's smiling. Now she knows what's going on. Not only that, but the guy's desires was st stolen. Yeah, that is not good. Oh, that is not good. That... That was actually live on TV, right? Ooh, can't believe he spilled his beans like that. Even I thought he went overboard with it. So... Then, do you think that host had his desire taken by Alice? Yeah, that's what I think. Like, what kind of professional host would do that on live TV? Exactly! True. And that was a bit overboard. Like he was in his right frame of mind. Like, he wasn't even there and someone else was controlling him. Morgana, that's it! I don't know if all this is right, but his personality changed like when someone's heart was stolen. After the treasure? Maybe Alice can control anyone whose desire she steals. If the desire is turned over to the ruler, they wind up under their control. Like with Alice. I see. That would really explain it. Amazing as always, Lady Anne. Um. What that would mean. Yeah, she's brushing on, Bra brainwashing people. God damn it! Yeah, looks like it. <laughs> but I kind of, kind of figured out how the hell that. To be a ray of how does she do it? That's what I've always wanted too. I read about her in a magazine once, and I just really felt it's where like she was coming she from. She wants him to do it, and the in he the just, first place. it just happens. I wanted to see her in person. I can't want, now, I gotta put my finger on it. I wonder if that was all just Lady on. <laughs> Man, that was great. 
That was... Alice? Quick, hide! Yeah, you got it. Miss Alice, this is a public hall. Please, you must keep your voice down. Eh, it's fine. See? No one in sight. That's because anyway, you don't see him. Did you see that lady's face? She totally lost it up there. All those cushy, talking head types make the best faces when things finally stop going their way. Miss Alice, do you think you could stop doing these things? Huh? What do you mean? I was the victim on stage. <laughs> what is it that you want me to stop doing? I... I don't know how you're doing it, or why. But after seeing that, there has to be something. You... Oh! So you want me to punish you again? Do I... Ah, please! I'm sorry! Dude, you could just... Oh, oops! What a terrible accident! Just like what happened on set. A terrible accident. I'm still upset over it too, you know. Isn't it your job to take my side? Or are you asking to end up broken like my what last What a psychopath. Also, I'm about to sneeze again. stuck up in your room like he is? Ugh. Well, oh it doesn't God. matter anyway. It didn't. I don't want toys Ooh. that don't do as they're told. Then beg me to forgive you until it hurts as much as you hurt me with your words. Why don't you do what you did yesterday? Grovel with your face all messed up with snot. I'll take another video if you'd like. Come on, beg. Do it! Do it! I'm not gonna stop until you do, got it? <sighs> hey, the guy sounds like he's in real pain. If she doesn't cut it out... Hey, stop! And who is this? Me? I'm the most sexy guy ever. Now cut the sadistic crap, bitch. It was way too far. You said also you your outfit is stupid. Light for people. How the hell does that help? Uh. Oh, <laughs> we were just playing around, weren't we? Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah, I can see so that bullshit. The car now? Oh, hey, wait! God damn it. Hang on. Uh, are you on Takamaki? Uh, you know who I am? Yeah! I know all the models. I read every fashion magazine the day it comes out. Actually, I really admire you. Would you like to be friends? Uh oh. <laughs> You obviously got Emma, right? <laughs> My keyword is... Don't bother. I'd never accept someone who treats another person like that. Aww, too bad. But I do appreciate honesty. So, how about you? Would you like to be friends? Me? I'm passing two. Aww, two in a row. Hey. Yep. Hang on, you were at 705 the other day, weren't yep. you? The most You're sexy done. guy ever. Let's go. Yeah. Fuck you, bitch. I know outfit is stupid. A bummer. But I know I gave him one of my cards. Why doesn't he obey? Because you don't owe me, bitch. And then I stormed out and we came back here. Sorry about that, by the way. I was just so upset. No oh, more you it. needed. It's understandable. You did a fantastic job finding out about Alice. Yeah, it's all thanks to you, Lady On. Um, Once Lady what about had me? her on the ropes, she whipped out her phone and tried adding them all on Emma right away. From what we saw, she might know that she can use Emma to lure people into her jail. She gets them into her jail, then takes their desires so they'll do what she says. I suspect she's been doing this for a while now. I see. That does explain things. I need to take a break. I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> okay. It's gone. What is her end goal? 
can't Not imagine that I such hate. awful behavior actually doing her any good. Is it the same as with Kamoshida? That's a good point. Ugh, she seemed to be having a blast being such an awful person. Whatever it is, yeah, not she has the girl to set up bitch. that kind of tragedy on live TV. She isn't in her right mind anymore. The longer we leave this be, the more victims that pile up. And it's already gotten to be quite a pile. Now's the time to act. But just how should we act? Is there a treasure in her jail? That's the tricky part. I am picking up a faint scent of something treasure-like, but... What is it, treasure? Are you treasure? having trouble finding it? It's the condensed pore of a ruler's desires. That's what gives birth to a palace and powers it. Usually, we just take the treasure to trigger a change of heart in our target. Hmm, that's interesting. What if there is no treasure there? Huh. We can't change Alice's heart. For now, let's focus on tracking the treasure like scent Morgana mentioned. That should at least put us on the trail for clues. Question, why must we change Alice's heart? Why? Hmm? Because she's hurting people. So exactly. Alice only needs to be stopped. Changing her heart is unnecessary. No, beating her shadow won't help. Worst case scenario, it could wind up causing her to die in the real world. Death. Yep. That is an acceptable outcome. <laughs> what? No. Dude, no. I'm no. humanity's companion. I'm supposed to determine the best choices for humanity. But that's not the best choice. People suffer every day. We should ensure she stops this as soon as possible. Why not do so? Guys, no, people can't. People can change. I do not understand. I want to understand, but I cannot. Where is the flaw in my logic? I do see where you're coming from, Sophia. Alice is doing horrible things. We could just help all those people without caring what happens to her. The metaverse is serious. You can end a life without ever being endangered. Even still, we always choose to change someone's heart instead of harming them. It's part of the Phantom Thieves code. That's right. Kind of pointless if we gotta stoop to the bad guy's level to take him down. We never kill. We steal the desires of the wicked and make them change their ways. Mm -hmm. exactly. That's why we're the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Phantom Thieves of Hearts. I've got it. Hearts. I lack a heart. That's why I don't understand the logic of the Phantom Thieves. If only I could I mean... understand how hearts work. If I did that, I could become an even better companion. Sophia? I suppose. I've got it. I will join the Phantom Thieves. I need to learn more about hearts so I can become an even better companion. May I join the Phantom Thieves? If I do so, I am certain I will witness many things about the human heart. I need to learn more about the heart. And about the Phantom Thieves. You're already one of us, sweetie. Thank you. No. Thank you for joining, Sophia. Welcome to the Phantom Thieves. Glad to I have mean, you she's already us. is. But Let's pick our code name next. Ooh, now oh yeah, we still haven't uh, picked that one. Mm. No, because she's white. Because of all you know? the white? Sounds like a dog's name to me. Shut up. Sounds like a name for a white dog, or maybe an ironic name for a black cat. What? What are you looking at me for? <laughs> maybe we should avoid picking anything that makes her sound like a pet. What if we went along the same lines we used with Mona-chan? After all, we met her inside the metaverse the same way. Like, how about Sophie? It's basically her name. I like I... it. Well, you there too? you go. I want to be Sophie. Then you'll be Sophia in this world and Sophie in the metaverse. Radical, oh, yeah. dude. It's, it's <laughs> different, the same name, but pronounce is different, like I guess? I am constantly learning things. Thanks to the internet. I'm learning more words as I speak. Don't pick up any off-putting lingo, okay? Okay. So yes, be careful. Remember, now we need to come up with our first mission. I'm going to stop Alice. Good. This feels like our duty, considering we became phantom thieves to help anyone suffering. I was one of those people once. We may not know the victims personally, but 
would reflect on us poorly as phantom thieves to not lend a helping hand. As long as there are people in trouble out there, we won't turn our backs on them. You're right. We're going to be the ray of light for everyone. That even includes Alice. I have registered myself as a phantom thief. Alright! Congrats! Phantom thieves are back in action! Fuck yeah. Oh, this. <laughs> yeah, bots. Um, as we go through this game, we also get to increase our bond. And each uh, one of those bonds helps with different things. I like to increase first the uh, XP ones. It's a fact that provision is prevention. We'll all need weapons and other supplies. Since you're the guy with all the connections, we'll leave the shop into you like always. We'll get ourselves ready. Once you are too, just hit us up. Well then, I guess we're gonna have to go in hey. buy the sub. Oh man, it's been so long since that. But right now I'm gonna have to stop right here. So yeah, run please. I'd like the video, subscribe, comment, hit the bell. And I'll see you all on the next video. Bye-bye.